My name is Melissa Bryant. This week, Brother John will be speaking to us about growing in our worship unto the Lord. The scripture passage for this week is Psalms 100, which says, Make a joyful shout to the Lord, all you lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know that the Lord, he is God. It is he who has made us and not we ourselves. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Be thankful to him and bless his name. For the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting and his truth endures to all generations. Psalms 100 is unique among the Psalms in that it is relatively short, being only five verses long. However, its focus is powerful and impossible to miss. The tone is certainly celebratory. It doesn't include any deep wrestling with the injustices of life or any of the psalmist's personal struggles. It's pretty straightforward from start to finish. Make a joyful and thankful noise unto the Lord. Without a doubt, this is the attitude that ought to fill and overflow our hearts as we enter into this new season that lies ahead for us. Wouldn't it be wonderful if our lives looked even more like Psalms 100 in the year to come? It is so important for us to know what God's Word has to say concerning Him. His Word discloses His goodness and His love and His mercy, His forgiveness, His healing, His redemption, and His restoration. I could go on forever and ever. The more we invest in our knowledge of God from the Scriptures, the more we desire to worship Him. So this new year, in this season of newness, let's consider how we can increasingly fill our minds with who God is and all the amazing things that He has done for us. Here's to a new year, a fresh perspective, and a renewed purpose. May we worship deeper, serve better, love unconditionally, be thankful, and always put Jesus first in our lives.